We have the artist, uh, she's a neurosurgeon from Thailand. Her name is Warlex, uh, and she helps a lot of projects, including this one with doing very good banners and arts. Uh, Warlock, you there? And we'd like to have her show around. Are you there, Warlock? I hope you didn't bail. Uh, well, I should have checked with her before I announced it. And, well, I can, always edit, I can always edit this out. Warlock, well, she's, she's here. She's here now. Oh, she's here. Warlock, you there? Yes, she's showing herself now. Warlock, Warlock, Luke, uh, hi, how are you? Well, thank, you so much. thank you, thank you <laughs> so much for the invitation. This is a honor for me to be here, and we are going to to make a good job. I'm I'm very sure in the next lectures. Uh, thank you. Okay, a, a mix of art and neurosurgery. Okay, Warlex, can you take over? Okay. Um, so this is my. Actually, it's the. Uh, it's kind of like. Really. So I want to talk about uh, what I'm doing. Uh, but first of all, I want I would like to thank Dr. Victor that uh, he taught us about the basics anatomies and cranial um, craniometric light, which is really uh, yeah. important. You know, and uh, I remember when I was a uh, neurosurgical resident, I have to prepare the a cadaveric head by myself too. I have to take it from the glass lab and after the shop of the head, I have to put that and rinse in the water, rinse the blood out and fix it with the formalins. And uh, here in Thailand, we use the, um, uh, some, some color and put in that and prepare for the uh, cadaveric. And in my center, we did more than uh, six to seven cadaveric workshops. Per year, so yeah, wow. a lot. <laughs> yeah, you, you're gonna show us around your art site, your art work, etc. Could you yeah, do yeah. it, please? Okay. Okay. You know, I kid no I say she's she's an artist that has a hobby, in neurosurgery. No. <laughs> Not the other way around. Okay, so you see my presentation. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so you guys see my presentations, right? Yes, sure. Okay, yes. so this is uh, the latest poster that I make for this grand opening of Neuroatomy TV in which uh, Dr. Victor, he did the uh, first presentation. So uh, I put my art like at the background and uh, yeah, I like dark color more. And uh, so we have upcoming like amazing panelists that Dr. Vladimir, uh, Victor's eyes and Luke's. So um, for people who don't know me, this is my information if you're interested in my work. I'm a neurosurgeon in Thailand, and I also do medical illustrations. And this is my website if you're interested, and my Instagram and Facebook page, so you can follow my art. And uh, for a lot of questions from the people ask me privately, um, I am full-time neurosurgeon, <laughs> and uh, right now I currently do my uh, neurovascular endovascular fellowship in Bangkok, Thailand. My art work, I do it uh, as my duty to draw an operative note almost every day that I draw it. And uh, I used uh, iPad Pro. I did not use uh, illustrate illustrations program. I use uh, Procreate. Uh, applications. If you are interested, uh, i okay to teach you. You can ask me privately. Uh, I use this program because it's easy to use, transfer, save the files, and it can make a beautiful operative note. Um, I'm not a professional artist. I'm not an artist um, since I was born. I never learned art, but I mean, believe me, I mean, you guys can do it. And uh, this is my uh, Instagram. If you um, um, take a look at, at the beginning as I told you I did not like you know do art as my job I do it's only my uh, my duty for you know for for uh, my uh, my 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 careers and my like uh, study to, so, uh, to write to write your post-operative notes in a, in a, in a, in a drone way that's excellent that's really fun yeah. 
Thank you. Yeah, so now I, I, I do, I, I practice on the, uh, I, I know people like, uh, I do like a lot of surgery of uh, cerebral uh, aneurysms, but I know some of people comment me that you can planning on the 3D CTA, but in my center, my mentor, he told me to draw it too, pre-operative view, and he let me uh, guess which uh, shapes and type of clip that I have to use, you know, so it's kind of like lots of imaging, so that I have to look at the 3D CTA before, and the answer is uh, when I when I um, attend in the operative mode and in the operative field, and I know what is the answer, yeah. <laughs> Uh, so, yeah, this is the Victor that I want to take a uh, leave a message for every uh, resident that periodic or is uh, important. So this is the picture that I used to draw when I was uh, with a new surgical resident. It's a video. <laughs> and this is my website. I'm not really like updated much, but it's only like showcase. Hey, what's the address of that website, Warlick? Said? Um, can, you, can you type it up there or put it in the chat in case anyone okay. wants to look at it? Okay. okay. Hey, there it was, War G. There were, was War G something. I thought I saw it there. <laughs> and uh, I, I uh, illustrate for uh, textbook two or three in Thai. And uh, right now I currently do the art for some of the new surgeons that they asked me. I mean, the poets, I. I love to do it because it it's correlate to my work. So, especially for the anatomy. So I also, besides you know surgical anatomy, I also do for um, other anatomy as well. So it is for anatomy of abdominal wall, in which if it's launched, I will show you later. This is the yeah <laughs> some other field that it's I'm not that familiar That's with. That's extra, right? <laughs> <laughs> That's a bonus. I guess you're gonna take that one out the next presentation. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but come on. If you are like, you know, you're a doctor, you have oh, to that's study. true. That's true. Yeah, I'm sure not everybody's shocked. <laughs> yeah, but you know that I, I'm a neurosurgeon that I have to fix the artery in the kidney. <laughs> <laughs> Then, uh, yeah, vascular is related to us because sometimes we operate on the neck. So it's uh, all the fields that I like about this, about the neck anatomy, something like that. And uh, yeah, hepatol like anatomy is that I have to fix that lot of things with the gallbladders and liver or something. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> okay, didn't you have some other accounts? You have an Instagram, right? You have a lot of stuff on that? Yeah. Okay, but it's, yes. that's hard to share. Any <laughs> other artwork uh, you want to share? Can, we, can you show the banners that you've made? I mean, really quick. I mean, you made a bunch of banners for us. Just show a couple. A banner like that I do? Yeah, for Yuha. The banners that you did for Yuha. Okay. You have those handy? Yeah, actually, I have lots of private work that I do for some many. Yeah, Yuha, as everyone knows, that he does uh, grand rounds on Fridays at eight o'clock China time. And Warlocks has been nice enough to be making the uh, banners and I think it's drawing a lot of more attention. Of course, Yuha would get a lot of attention wherever he goes, but having these banners helps and Yuha appreciates it. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> really excellent. I, I, th I think being a neurosurgeon and artist at the same time uh, is really a very, very big advantage for not only of you, Waralox, I mean it is for all of us. Uh, when you look to the beautiful uh, books of Professor Yazargil, uh, prof beautiful books or drawings of Professor Rotten before the era of the colored uh, cameras and the digital cameras, I mean, always. Uh, I mean, when you look to the surgical books, which was done by plenty of uh, of artists, 
uh, you go to the old editions which we studied in in Buckingham and uh, I mean Cunningham and 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 uh, Grant's Atlas and the uh, and the Gray's Anatomy. These are people who was artists like you. They love drawing. They know how to put the anatomy in the 3D on a paper, uh, and at the same time they know the anatomy. I mean, you cannot be drawing something that you don't know. You cannot draw some scientific thing with proper anatomical relationships without really knowing what is this anatomy or what is this surgery. So I think you are a real gain to the uh, area of neurosurgical uh, teaching. Uh, you should not uh, hide your uh, hobby and your capabilities. It is really something which we should all uh, encourage and get benefit from. I think that uh, Professor Perez maybe agrees with me for that, no? I mean, when you want to draw something, you cannot draw it if you don't have both capabilities, the uh, anatomy knowledge and uh, being able to uh, give life to the photo on paper. So uh, good work. I congratulate you for that. And uh, please don't stop. Continue and progress more and more. Don't uh, only uh, be satisfied with the with the banners for uh, Professor uh, Dr. Bennett, but only for everything in anatomy. Don't take her away can... from us. Don't take her away from <laughs> no, us. No, 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 no. We are not. We don't want to take care from you. You are the star of neurosurgery. Now you are leading all the neurosurgical webinars over all the world, from east in China to west in. Uh, states and and uh, uh, latin america including all the world you are the star of neurosurgery oh, and you will remain the star inshallah mm -hmm. thank you and, and we hope, we're just starting we're just starting uh, yeah. and we're really glad to have uh, this association with bangladesh because uh, we haven't had any conferences before with bangladesh but i'm glad to start uh, and this uh, and, and then have warlix drop in and say i want to show my artwork i mean this is great I mean, this is, it's meant to be used. Uh, it's a great visual medium. And, and, and let, me, uh, let me show you something, actually. Uh, I want to show you guys uh, what we're doing in the future. OK, what I'm doing is I'm building studios for people like Victor, uh, anatomists and neuro, neurosurgeons who love to give anatomy lectures. I'm bu I built studios, uh, like, like this studio I built for Victor where it's a, a little it's a little different that's a little time delay but that it's also on his studio it's a different interface i think because it gives a viewer an option of getting information like victor's profile uh it takes you to his web facebook youtube questions you can ask live on youtube questions uh on that uh let me get back here but um uh, so if any, uh, Victor, you like your studio? You can decorate yeah. it. You can, you can de yeah. decorate it like a Mexican bus. You know how all the buses and Mexicans are decorated in Mexico? John, John Bennett, John Bennett I, I feel really honored uh, for uh, seeing this uh, studio. Uh, I, am, I promise I'm going to do my best in the next course. Oh yeah, we're just starting with you, Victor. But you know, any, like this is a good example, like any webinar Victor does, he doesn't have to be with us, he can be doing with another organization. We'll try to put it into his studio uh, because there's ways of doing that also, uh, that we can take other streams from other broadcasts and put it in your studio. So again, I, I repeat, any neuroanatomists or neurosurgeons who do a lot of neuroanatomy, just let me know and we'll broadcast your neuroanatomy because I think I would like to see neuroanatomy 24 hours a day, <laughs> like, okay. like music, like music, because uh, people thought when MTV started, now come on, who's going to listen to music 24 hours a day? But nowadays the world is small. Uh, and, and not necessarily one area of the world will do all the neurosurgery webcasts, but one country's getting up and the other country's going to sleep. And, and it's a, if, if it's organized, I think it can be done. But of course, that's in the future. But I think 
we can start to have uh, more neuroanatomy online, more, more, so that you can always tune in. That's one thing I was impressed when I started neurosurgical uh, TV was the passion and the dedication to learning neuroanatomy. The great neurosurgeons, I bet you they're also the great neuroanatomists too. Uh, I think they work, they work together. Uh, exactly. So, so uh, I hope really to put a, a lot of neuro, uh, neuroanatomy uh, online and have other people participate. Hi, John. Yes. Can you, can you uh, give us uh, light uh, for, uh, for the next uh, lectures or webinar regarding this Rotem series? Okay, uh, it's, the same, uh, it's the same link. Uh, the, the, you mean the link to get in? No. What are the lecture contents down the line for the? Oh, okay. Years? Yeah, that's a good idea. Let, let me show that. Okay. Uh, yeah. That's part of production. And Muhammad's keeping me on my toes. <laughs> okay. Okay. Here we go. Yeah, Victor gives a couple more. Okay, we just did Victor Hugo Perez Perez with the inaugural. Uh, Abitha Shah, she was in the webcast for a while. Are you still there, Abby? I guess now she's stepped away. She's from India. She's giving it next week on white fiber dissection, central core. And there's the rest of the schedule. Uh, and Victor is giving a bunch. I've been doing it for years with Victor. And uh, he has he has the advantages of speaking Spanish too. He has a very wide following. Uh, and and Victor, you're in Mexico City downtown, or do you work from your home? No, uh, um, uh, specimens. Uh, I work them in the Forensic Sciences Institute here in Mexico City. Okay. Can you show us that your website, the forensic uh, work you're doing? That that. For, uh, you have okay. that candy? Okay, uh, uh, in the next lectures, I can okay. show you uh, the, the, the place. Yes. I'm well, pretty sure I'll show you my pictures to the Everglades. <laughs> okay, so is someone showing something? Okay, I think, uh, I guess we can wrap it up, Mohammed. We, yeah, yeah. That, yeah. that second part wasn't part of, of the neuroanatomy. That's uh, artist. And then Warlock, thanks a lot for an impromptu uh, presentation. And uh, we'll see all you guys. Thanks, Victor. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you, everybody. Okay, we'll just start. We'll just start, Victor. Thank you, Bennett. Thank you, Warlock. Thank, thank you, everybody. Thank you, everybody. Thank you, Shafiq Islam. Yeah. Bye. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So it's just beginning. Thank you, sir. Yes, have a long it's just the beginning.